Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Thursday night. Shmup Book Club. We're playing some more Rayforce tonight. Last time we played it, we did okay. Almost a million and a half, um, which puts us in pretty good position on the boards we got going here. Um, but we can probably do better. We can probably do better. Looks like it's going to be kind of slim tonight, at least on the call, but we'll join in anyways and uh, make ourselves an appropriate amount of noise. Let's go. Play with... Hello, Mr. Bond. Good evening. I'm copying files. <laughs> oh, the most exciting. From one hard drive to another. The most exciting shmup. The files. <laughs> I'm just being sociable. Oh, that's good. It gives me, keeps me from going insane while I'm just sitting here copying files and watching file progress. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Yellow EI. Yellow. Yellow there. My, my life is file copy operations. Sounds like fun. No, it isn't. You know it's not fun. <laughs> I don't even pretend. Hello, Bonding EI. Hello. Good evening. Apparently, Mame seems to think that I want to play uh, Rayforce for ants. Thanks. <laughs> what is this? A shmup for ants? <laughs> Might actually be a pretty cool shmup. Maybe. Maybe. Hard to tell. Hard to see. Oh, shit. I would go uh, AMD with the graphics card, but I need a NVIDIA's NVENC for streaming. Because no I'm still CPU running a. I say. Well, if I had a uh, AMD processor, I would do that, but I do not. I'm still running a fourth gen i7, hmm. which does everything that I need it to. Still, I'm, I'm using me. That's what I'm on right here. I'm going from a uh, Haswell Lake, the late Haswell Lake, to uh, a Zen 3 2900. Oh, so got what I'm supposed to do here. Bit of an upgrade. I need to figure out what I'm doing with this box once I'm not using it actively anymore. That's the worst part. Hmm. I don't know where I missed the laser, but I missed the laser. Guess I'm restarting. Don't miss laser. Thanks. How could you miss a laser? I don't know. Always don't miss laser. I don't know what a good stage one score is anymore. It's been like three weeks since I played this. Or I'm sorry, area one. I call them areas because they're fancy. There are no good <laughs> scores. Oh. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah. I would love to go X264 because as good as Envank is, what a lot of people don't realize is X264. While it's great for a lot of things, whenever it comes specifically to T to uh, 2D shop, especially bullet hell stuff, X264 just does it better. But it was cheaper for me to get the graphics card than a whole new computer, so I just got the graphics card. There I go. Yeah, yeah. air cop. I'm going to assume you got that before. Um... <laughs> The prices the started going totally during the industry started just eating itself. During I looked at, I got a thirty sixty at MSRP. Nice. Oh wow! Nice. nice. Which I was really surprised I was able to do so because I was actually in Berea in Kentucky at a plant, and their internet structure is awful. So I'm actually surprised I got in to get the purchase because they did it at noon and I was at work. I mean, hey, sometimes oh, it works but out. I got it, yeah. Good old Berea, Berea, Kentucky. I was about to say Texas. I'm like, that's not where Berea is. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I, know, I know where Berea's been. I've been there. <laughs> Ooh. 
Please do not shoot. Thank you. I've been to a surprising number of places in Kentucky for no good reason. I love thinking about it. <laughs> Considering I've never lived in Kentucky. Yeah, uh, Pittsburgh Glassworks has one of their main plants there. And the tech needed some help, so I drove six hours down for a week. And then I started that Arcade Legacy on the way back, which is pretty nice. I got to see oh, Jesse again. I keep saying once pandemic winds down proper, I need to go to Gelf and Ghost since it's not too oh, far yeah, from us. For sure. I've heard nothing but good things. Penny speaks highly of it, so I guess it was pretty good. Oh, the shit bag. Right, okay. See, so, yeah, I just need to plan it for plan it for a week when there's stuff that I want to play there. Like when there's stuff cycled in that I want. That's always the concern. Yeah, I don't know how. Oh, so shit. they cycle it on a weekly oh. basis. I don't know if it's weekly or monthly if they move, shuffle stuff around, or there's some stuff that's like pretty. Like I'm sure there's some stuff they don't change out. Period. Because it's like you know, like fucking. They like, do a new game every with. Monday, so there's at least one new game every Monday. Yeah, so I just keep an eye on their game because I'm pretty. They have a Galvin Ghost does it, has their list online, don't they? With whatever's. I'm pretty sure stuff. they do. Yeah. I can't imagine them not. They they seem pretty on the ball in general, so I just want to go to play their uh, predator pinball they have. Mm. <laughs> it's the only Thanks, one dude. in the world. Wow. Why why is there only this was like a like a beta table? No, it was a uh, it was a minor company thing uh, thing went bad, and basically they pulled the same thing that Dutch Pinball did with. Um, uh, Big Lebowski, mm. to where um, basically small company ran out of money, screwed over a bunch of customers, very few got out. Mm. Nuts. Yeah. I should say there's only one. I think there's a, there there might be more, but there's a. It's probably in the single digits. They say it's probably the only publicly available one. Yeah, it's definitely the only publicly available one. <laughs> That just makes me wonder about the whole, like, people taking ROM dumps of stuff, the stuff that there's no, like, publicly available copies, like, they get into, like, private collections and take dumps. I mean, that's me, definitely it, been a thing that's happened over the yeah, years. Yeah, well, like, the ethics about it's really wonky. Yeah. It depends on how you feel about things. Because, mm -hmm. like, from my perspective, I feel like there's no reason not to take a dump if you have a copy. Because preservation is a thing. For pres yeah, because preservation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But there are a bunch of collectors that are like, burr, burr, hoo, hoo, hoo. only I may have this. My collector's yeah. value. Yeah, I, I mean, honestly, it's like buying that damn Wu Tang's, like buying that damn Wu Tang CD. <laughs> I, I have very little sympathy for. Uh, like collectors that are willing to let a thing completely die if it means that they're the only one that got to have it un up until the point where it's gone. Like, no, fuck that. Yeah, no, that's no good. One thing I can say, uh, while it is not released, Beavis and Butthead is dumped. It's just that Viacom has a very tight knit on who has it. Hmm. So they know Some, if it gets released, who to go surprised. after. Yeah. But according to Galloping Ghost, it is dumped. It is preserved. It's just not released because of Viacom. Fun. Yeah, and, and that's the other thing. Is like, I'm cool with people having dumps in this, just not publicly released, too. But like, you have backups and there's 7 million copies of it, so that way, you know. If a meteor hits the one physical copy, it's not forever. Yeah, it's yeah. not gone forever. <sighs> oh, what the fudge? That was a bullet, huh? Alright. Very good. 
was in fact a bullet. Sneaky little bitch. Killed the boss and it's and I died and I killed the boss and I gotta redo it. <laughs> Wait, which game? Zeroing. Mm. Uh, don't. I was yeah, gonna say zero zero. zero, zero to are, to, to, uh, to play would be disrespectful enough to just kill you on double KO. Like, ha ha, you lose. That's a pretty peak toe plan to be honest. Better luck next time, idiot. Maybe consider not being bad, toe plan probably. <laughs> Why don't you try hard? <laughs> uh, except they're not kind enough to say that. I mean, Bond, this is also the game that tells you to watch yourself, kid. Mm, so, yeah. Uh... Yeah. We all make little sacrifices sometimes. Right. That folder is copied. Okay, I am too bad at Ray Force today. I'm giving up on that already. Aww. Don't you aw aw me, mister. Aw. <laughs> bon, did you ever figure out mm -hmm. why your, like, Discord audio sometimes skips and you get, like, the double? The doubles? No. I've never been able to isolate <laughs> that. It's like, why is it when I'm watching a stream on Discord, does it suddenly introduce background noise into my uh, audio? Um, my because input? Discord hates your audio interface personally. I mean, you're probably right. <laughs> are you using your phone or are you using your computer? I'm on my computer. Oh, okay. It are you using like a, a Realtek sound card? Because Realtek sound cards are just awful in yeah, general. Yeah, Realtek's are not great. No, I, I'm not using a Realtek sound card. <laughs> in fact, well, I'm not... you're using like a... What, I, what are... a I am using the Focusrite uh, 6i6 second gen audio interface. Oh, wow. Uh, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a, re I'm a real musician. <laughs> it's true. I say, I say, I say, someone jokingly. I mean, you, you have, like, officially released music. That I, re I released give and you money for. Yeah, I released and song. And song. I should probably like release more and songs, but here we are. I should check my YouTube handles. Actually, while I'm thinking about it. Here, here we are. But again, it's undeniable. You have released music that people can give you money for. I need to get back into DJing. I believe people trading money for your goods and services makes you a professional. If they trade money money? Money money. Actual money. My channel. Mm, yep, looks about as I expected. Yeah, five views on five views is my highest viewed video. Nice. That is greater than zero. That is a number above zero. What the fudge? Ah, you shit. Oh, why did you go off the screen? Oh, wow. Okay. Sure. So the other day, <laughs> I discovered that the 11 foot 8 bridge has been raised by 8 inches. Yeah. Yes, and it, ha it has been very has not, desolate has, ever since. <laughs> that, that has not stopped people from writing to the bar. I was going to say, there have been some incidents since it and became several, a 12 several foot 4 since... bridge. <laughs> It's eleven foot eight plus eight. Oh, oh yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> it's the brandy oh, now. Eleven foot sixteen. Right. Got it. Ah, uh, yes. My favorite measurement. <laughs> I'm just more impressed by the drone shots they took of the bridge after it was raised. 
solid solid drone cinematography. Also, I already hate drone cinematography. <laughs> Then again, anytime I see it, I, anytime I hear a drone flying overhead, my immediate caveman instinct is to throw a rock at it and murder it, so. Uh, well, you know, gotta flying fight, the, thing bad. fight that singularity any way you can. Flying giant bug kill! <laughs> no, that sounds about right. That's That sounds like about my instincts if I see a giant bug flying around. Hello, you are not allowed to be in my airspace. Get the fuck out. And then, uh, very probably that bug will shortly be no more. Bond. Yeah. Have you, have you considered playing the games great? I'm trying. It's real tough sometimes. Okay, very good. Carry on. Also, Twitch seems to think that Ray Force is an indie game. I was curious about that the other night, too. I'm like, <laughs> hmm, well, we have very... little company you've never heard of called Taito. Taito, yeah. yeah have... Taito, that, like, l very <laughs> little-known uh, small developer... <laughs> Taito. Have, have very different definitions of indie, apparently. Uh, you know, that the creator of the very little known game Space Invaders, <laughs> you probably haven't heard of it. No. Nope. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it had the. Very, very, obs very obscure. Very extremely obscure games and company. 8 bit graphics. Nobody, nobody uh... knows who Taito be or anything that they have ever done. <laughs> Obvious. Oh, that being said, I would love to own a Kix. I love Kix, and then... that's definitely one of those games I feel like that should hopefully be on FPGA soon. For some I... reason, it's not yet. I could see it. People, sometimes there's just no one implementing a driver for it. And you, gotta be, you gotta be the one. You gotta be the change you want to see in the world. <laughs> All right, let's not just go just be just be that guy that did a Dodon Pachi FPGA like a FPGA implementation Dodon Pachi oh, for his thesis. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of work. Yeah, I mean, I mean, if that's already if that's already your area of study in college, why not? Why not yeah, just emulate? I guess. Why not emulate a cool video game? I mean. I can't argue the point, I guess. Not a bad idea. And if you're doing it as a thesis, then obviously you're getting value out of it uh, academically in terms of, yeah, I did this thing well, and it thing, gave me right? a degree. And you get to hang your hat on the fact that you uh, you were the one to make the FPGA implementation of it, and a whole bunch of nerdos would be like, holy shit, this dude's cool. They made an FPGA <laughs> implementation of Dodon Patch. Or Dodon Patch, I don't remember what you had said. I think it was Dodon Patch, but I could be wrong. Of some cave shmup. <laughs> Dodon Patch! Dodon Patch. Dodon Patch! <laughs> Duh, 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 dual patch. Oh shit! Okay. <laughs> this is the real reason I had to make sure to be on the call because it's just you know we we uh. missed the uh, the bond noises, so we got to get the bond noises back. Got to got to meet your quota. I guess. There. Okay. 
Well, rip all the allied ships or whatever, I guess. Yeah, they don't really do much, do they? They tried. They're I mean. just a dis they're a distraction. They're sacrificing themselves for you. Oh, well, they could have sacrificed a little bit harder because I just ate shit right after they did. Nice jobs. <laughs> nice jobs, idiots. <laughs> I think they were counting on, uh, on your competence level being a little higher. Well, gee, that seems like their fault, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> They gotta lower them expectations like a couple notches. Hey, what's up? It's Coin. Hey, how are you guys? Good evening. We, we're we're having a time. We're time mostly is... just uh, shit posting over Bond's stream at this point. Time is being. What? Yeah. Am I the only one actually streaming right See? now? Is that the thing? Yeah. Yes. Aww. That's a shame. So. I'm gonna t make an attempt at this R-type Delta. Do you? Is this the one that you have to go in and to your? Because I mean, I feel like it was like uh, uh, is it Einhinder? Is that it? Is that one of those that was made by Square Enix on yeah. PlayStation? Well, Square Soft. <laughs> Squ oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Very important so, distinction. <laughs> Very. So in that game, you had to go in and create a save file. Is R-Type Delta like that too? Where um, you have to go in the memory card first? I don't think so. Okay. Maybe, so, honestly, I don't know. I, I couldn't tell you. There is the possibility that you have to uh, set up something beforehand, but like, it's also perfectly fine to just kind of play a uh, credit of it well like so, in the menu it says guest it says i'm a guest oh yeah i think there's like a pilot registration yeah. or something if you want okay. if you want your name to be associated with the scores <laughs> on the high scoreboard uh, on your memory card say right. you have to do that but also okay. it doesn't really matter like it's not gonna make a difference beyond your name being on the high scores list when you make a high score, so... Yeah. Okay, okay. The game will play the same either way. I got my PS2 out here. I could play R-Type Delta tonight, too. Oh, oh shit. Nice. Time, time to wait 30 minutes for this to copy over to my hard drive, and then that'll be <laughs> all of the big folders. Very good. Oh, If you have a slim PS2, I recommend doing the Mechapone mod. I basically, basically, just by running a single file with um, free with a free uh, MC boot, you can basically convert any slim PS2 to be a dev kit, which will play any burned PS1 game without a mod chip or anything, and any region PS2 game. Very neat. I might have to do that because uh, the lens on my actual Japanese PS2 is completely fucking shot. <laughs> Womp. So I Nicole had thinks I'm for a minute. <laughs> so Nicole thinks I'm weird, but I actually have a fat PS2 to play PS2 games on my hard drive. Uh, and then I, I have a slim yeah, PS2 the for the hard drive. Oh. Yeah. And then a slim PS2 to play PS1 games because slim PS2 has the best laser for. The best laser. <laughs> yes, the, the, this is the true statement. These are true statements. This all tracks, Incredible. yeah. So I have two PS2s, one for PS1 games, one for PS2 games. Considering have... my US Slim PS2 could play rhythm games without terrifying things happening on burned DVDs using a swap disc, I think it has a good laser. Very good. Fair. I have, like four PS2s, and only about one of them is actually functional right now. You should definitely do some hard drive mods. It's super easy to do. I mean, I should, but mm -hmm. I also can't be bothered. Sensing something okay. to do with effort here. <laughs> Bond, I can't believe that you are a practiced master of the pattern recognition. Yeah, I know. It's almost like I do that for my job most That's days. Our, our estimate's up to 40 minutes. Damn. Oh shit. It Slowed was 26, now, now it's 40. 
This is the this is the laziest copy ever. I have a folder on my hard drive for just downloads from Firefox that I never clean up. I'm literally just copying it on the machine. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I what mean, it's a play. That's uh, that's disorganization. It's a strat, I guess. It's something that one can do. And something that Beauty is in fact doing. Yeah. See, I think it works out. I mean. Considering I'm going to have uh, double the platter hard drive space and four times the SSD hard drive space, I think I can do this. I mean, fair cop. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Also, the concept of having platter hard drive space is just weird to me, but I apparently just don't store that much data. But my, both of my last two, like, primary computers were SSD only. Bond, why do you mm -hmm. just destroy one side? You could destroy both sides. I was going for the you, other side, but it was slightly off screen. Well, you, like, balance the damage that you do, too. I could have, but, you know, I didn't. Oh, now I really feel like a data hoarder. I have a 8 bay um, USB 3.0 hard drive thing that has 20 terabytes total in it. Shit. The only reason I don't have that what? kind of data storage capacity is because I just didn't want... I never had the money to invest in the setup. Oh, let's do that again. Sure, why not? Yeah, I feel like I'm the unusual one in not being a data hoarder more than anything here. I'm a data hoarder because I did oh, anime God. back before you could just get a subscription to anime streaming service. There, I guess. If you, wanted, if you wanted to watch animes, your options were shitty dubs or fan subs, which involved, like, being top-tier pirates. <laughs> top-tier pirates. Top-tier pirates. Not those shitty low-tier pirates, No, top -tier hell pirates. no. The, the good shit. If you want the obscure stuff, you can't just get it on Pirate Bay. Uh-uh-uh. You gotta be on some <laughs> weird-ass private trackers. <laughs> Uh, mine is no, no one's yeah. to battle. I'll pass. <laughs> mine is hundred percent. Um, well, more like ninety percent. Um, complete console collection of things like PS2 ISOs, PS1 ISOs, all that kind of good stuff. Which <laughs> is also a fair cop, yeah. That's how I started beauty. I, whenever the whenever oh, uh, yeah. Nintendo yeah. went the whole ban everything route i went gung-ho and i downloaded as much as i could as fast as i could very good as one does so i got like complete dreamcast complete ps1 ps2 uh saturn 3do cdi oh, cdi <laughs> that's a bold cdi <laughs> cdi all right so all right. so what i'm what i'm hearing is you're going to be playing one of gamelon here so oh no I actually want to get. <laughs> I actually want to get a CDI so I can play Thunder in Paradise. Yes, it is based off the TV show. Fast. Hmm. I wasn't going to ask any questions. <laughs> <laughs> if I if I, I wanted to get to anything at this point, it'd be Saturn emulation. Is there, like, has Saturn emulation actually progressed to the point where it's, like, vaguely usable by an end user? Or is it still, like, dozens of hours of troubleshooting like it used to be? Um, if you have a healthy, if you have a pretty hefty CPU, the, one of the cores on RetroArch is actually pretty decent for Saturn. That's good to know. I was, I was gonna say the, the, uh, STV driver on main is basically just a Saturn. Yeah, and that always ran like dog shit too. It runs fine nowadays well, if you have a beefy CPU. I, I mean, granted, my uh, the last time I tried to do any of this was a minute ago, so these are all very outdated opinions. It's okay, I don't judge. Well. Oh, Good, because wow. why would you judge me for not bothering to <laughs> set up Saturn emulation or try no, STV the, the, main the one, games? The, yeah, the, the, yeah, there's not a lot of good ones. So, like, <laughs> that's forgettable. And, and 
a lot of the ones that are good have been released in other friendlier <laughs> formats anyway. <laughs> I don't know. You're bending backwards like the There you go, Bond. You did the See, thing. I'm, I'm proud of you. I'm learning. Slowly, but learning. Oh, Bond, Mr. Bond. <clears throat> now, now that we have vaccines, can we do a charity event? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I want to come. I want to. I want to come hang out over by <laughs> you and your folks' places. <laughs> hang out in Torbot's basement again. <laughs> Well, unfortunately, well, basement that basement is, is no uh, more. Uh, they, they well, it relocated. belongs to somebody yeah. else. Yeah, it's someone else's basement. I don't think they would nah. appreciate us going over there. You, you never know. Maybe, right. they, maybe, they want, maybe they want. Maybe they want to. Maybe they want to show us charity event out of their basement. I mean, stranger things have happened. I guess. I guess. Uh, but I had to. I, I had to check my home and homeowner's policy, but I'm. If someone randomly came to me and be like, "Hey, we used to do charity events here. Can we, can we run your basement for the weekend? We'll bring all our equipment and set it up." <laughs> like, um, uh, yeah, if you're covering the utility costs, sure, yeah, whatever. I do agree with the general sentiment, though. Like, that needs to be a thing now that we can actually like be in physical presence without uh, it being a potentially disastrous health event. And that's what we're calling it now, yes. Right. I mean, you're not wrong. Also, also, also help, I have Adam Neely's cover of Castaways from the Backyard again. <laughs> 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 no. Well, you see, Castaways by the Backyard again is this year's summer hit. Single. I, I see. Thanks, TikTok. It's a good song, oh. actually. It is legitimately good music. It's it's that I'm gonna pull back up in PDQ box, um, or Terio. PDQ box being a um, wonderful, wonderful music theory ship host meme composer. Movement four, in particular, is a wonderfully terrible joke. <laughs> but it, requ it requires you to be like a music nerd to get. Mm. Well, then Damn. I'm out. <laughs> Elitist memes. Look, yeah, it's a fume joke. Thanks, I hate it. We're teaching Olivia words to things, and I keep ask, I keep telling her, uh, "Where's James Hetfield at?" And I wanted to point to the table. I just have. I take it nobody's Metallica fans. I um, couldn't hurry. I didn't hear exactly what you what, yeah, what the joke I, was, so I couldn't. Oh, uh, okay. I so James. <laughs> so James Hetfield made I said, I an thought, album. I thought I, I thought I heard Hetfield, and I was, I was like, "Yeah, I didn't I'm hear sorry, James." Properly, so I was like, ja "Yeah, James Hetfield and the Table." So they made an album, and I forget who it was. It was uh, talking about the lyrics. It's it's really weird. Anyways, James Hetfield just out of nowhere screams, "I am the Table," uh. for no reason at all whatsoever. And ever since then, if you were in the Metallica memes and stuff. That's been a meme. So I wonder if that's the clip that they've been that they've used in the wrestling meme land for when tables don't break. Probably. Because that's a that's a that's a that's a thing that that's a like thing on a thing. Uh, long running uh, wrestling YouTube series Botchamania, which highlights botches and other oddities in wrestling events. Including my favorite segment, you talk too much, in which it's just WWE footage, in which you can clearly hear the wrestlers talking to each other, telling them what, what moves to do. <laughs> Excellent. And for and for like two years straight, it was just always John Cena because John Cena talks too much. He's too loud. Damn it, John He's Cena! Quite loud, isn't he? Calm yourself down. 
It's because he's invisible well, and you can't see him, so he has to be loud. He has to speak up so you can hear him. Uh, <laughs> well, to be fair, if you were in John's shoes, you just pretty much don't care anymore. I wouldn't. I, I mean, that's the that's the weirdest part because like he's at the point in his career where he doesn't have to give a fuck, and he looks keep going putting out good performances regardless <laughs> of what stupid shit they make him do. Like, there were legitimate complaints you could make back early in his career when WWE decided to make him the next Hulk Hogan, but like, he turned out to be a good worker and like he does good. He puts together good matches. It's just. When he always wins, it's boring. <laughs> that appears to be Bamani data in that downloads folder. Whoops. Damn, Bamani stuff. Probably popping. Oh, what? <laughs> We're at about 16 minutes. I don't know when we were about 40 minutes, but now we're at about 16 minutes. Time's an illusion. Lunchtime doubly so. Yeah, also true. Well, you see, my hour of lunch takes an hour and a half, so... Eh, all balances out, I guess. <laughs> this, is, this, is, this is called genius slacking in government work. I take my lunch at 11.30. Everyone else takes their lunch from 12 to 1. To no one thinks anything when I'm still on lunch from 12.30 to 1. <laughs> <laughs> Can't deny its effectiveness. We do realize that you've just stated this on stream now, and there's public record of you saying this, right? That's okay. Nobody watches my stream. You're safe. Also, Shit, fair cop. <laughs> I take my lunch at my desk, so I do answer calls when I get calls. Damn so. it, you weren't supposed to agree. <laughs> <laughs> I've worked. I've worked. I've worked. In, I've worked enough through my lunches that I, I deserve the extra time that I take otherwise. I do the same thing. I don't actually get a lunch. I just work on my desk and eat. We're supposed to take an hour lunch, but like they don't. They enforce it much more strictly with the hourly workers because they're paid hourly. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, I mean that. But for that tracks, yeah. That's that's the one that confuses me to know, and I have no idea why some of our people are hourly and some of us are salaried. Like it makes no goddamn sense. <laughs> um There's there's no apparent rhyme or reason to it as far as I can tell. There probably isn't a rhyme or reason to it to begin with. Mm -hmm. Which is why mm -hmm. the there why said rhyme or reason is also not apparent, because it didn't exist in the first place. Like, if we had a bunch of people who were still contractors because they hadn't been hired on yet, I'd get it. But I'm pretty sure we don't have any contractors right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, all of the holes, all of the positions we filled recently have been direct hires, so... I... I don't know. Hmm. This is a mystery. Man, that, that, made, that made me a little sad. So I remember we had to find a new infrastructure person because our... our Senior infrastructure guy died. That was that was sad. That's oof. He was, he was in as as far as I recall, he was in some sort of automotive or motorcycle accident and then passed away like within two or three days after. Oof. Yeesh. <laughs> That's uh Oof. So so yeah, you ever you ever talk about bus factor? We had a oh, I was gonna bring that up, but I thought it wouldn't have been good. So. Uh, luckily, <laughs> luckily, 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 it would have been. Luckily, it was after. Um, I don't remember what happened now, but it was after we had implemented more stringent DR planning, so that we had like everything, most of the, the vast majority of like. There's like probably some like. I don't think every device configuration is backed up or documented everywhere, but like the majority of the, all the important stuff was. So wow. the only problem now is we've been having like a revolving door of like infrastructure guys coming through because like they last they sorry so, sorry someone's playing some hella bass and it's rallying my windows. 
strong base. base no trouble. Also, also, also old windows, so they rattle a lot. Uh, well, that'll happen. My house, my house was built in 1924. <laughs> okay, so I guess it's got some leeway to it. Which reminds me, I should probably email the city and see if, like, see if I qualify for the lead pipe replacement thing. That might be a good idea. Yeah. Oh right, the too many arms dude. Oh, I missed him. Too many arms dude. <laughs> too many arms. <laughs> oh, he got me with something. I didn't even see that. Good job, too many arms dude. You just got <laughs> slapped. That is a phrase I wasn't expecting to hear today. Quote, good job, too many arms, dude, unquote. I mean, he kind of earned that one. Like, I can't, I can't even be mad about it. <laughs> Spe speaking, speaking, <laughs> speaking of slaps, uh, Billy Mitchell's suing everyone again. <laughs> yeah, I heard that. Oh, boy. Because, you must, know... He, he... He fell off the news for a month, so he decided to start suing people again because he wanted I mean, to have people. I mean, he's attention. already indirectly a murderer because he sued someone into suicide, so, you know. Like. I, Billy, Billy, at, a, this, at this point. It's a at this special point, level of delusion to sue people for defamation that are just stating facts at you. Well, you see, he's taking advantage of the fact that he has a lot of money and it requires very little of his effort to make these lawsuits, while it requires a lot of effort from the other party's part to defend those lawsuits. Mm -hmm. Which is great right up until anti-slap. Uh... I was going to say, I don't know if Florida has anti-slap laws, but if they do, um, boy howdy, it's going to be funny. I know, he's made, I know he has at least one suit in California that's gonna, probably going to go to trial, I'm pretty sure California has some nasty anti-slap rules. They do. California they has some known for really it. brutal ones, which I mean, good because fuck slap lawsuits. Because, like, I, ironically, I think like the next worst after California is like Texas of all places. Huh. Interesting. Like Texas's anti-slap laws are pretty, so it's like pretty serious. Wouldn't have expected that yeah. in Texas. Honestly. I learned. I yeah, learned more either. about. I learned more about Texas anti-slap law than I ever expected to know. Following the saga. saga the Vic Mignogna lawsuit. <laughs> <laughs> in, in which anime voice actor man oh, sued other anime voice actor yeah. people okay, for which one you're talking, talking about, about times which in which he was the, um, yeah. basically uh, assaulted people. <laughs> so, which... And then he admitted to it in his deposition because his lawyer's awful. <laughs> yeah. yeah it's, so it's I'm sure right. that uh, worked real strongly in in his favor it didn't it did not narrative voice it did not work out narrative well. voice it was, this strategy backfired <laughs> it's okay they crowdfunded the lawsuits so they had enough God. in crowdfunding to cover the legal fees they had to pay out so other people paid for his stupid fucking dumb bullshit awesome yes I just need Billy Mitchell to sue someone that's in the EU and just watch EU <laughs> law get involved. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. I have a I have a feeling civil law. It's, it, it, I, could I, don't, I don't I don't know. Does anyone know anything about civil law in the EU? I don't, but I have no idea. It's probably I've, better I've, than I've it heard, here. I've heard slander and libel law in the UK is actually worse than it is in the US, weirdly enough. But like it's, regardless, it's, it's... I could see Billy Mitchell doing it. Yeah, it does seem yeah, like a sure. thing he would do. Billy Mitchell does seem to be unhinged from reality enough. I mean, he did, did try to retain a lawyer in Australia to see someone in Australia, so... Mm, interesting. <laughs> oh, fuck. Also, I appreciate that Todd Rogers is getting in on the game as well. Todd oh, Todgers, no. I believe. Todd, <laughs> you watched the video too, okay? <laughs> and, and the lawyer managed to file the initial complaint with, oh, the, with the complaint as Todd Todgers. <laughs> <laughs> and and Todd's not, getting I'm in on gonna, it now. Oh my yes, God. Oh, yes. Amazing. And I'm not gonna lie. Voice. If I were the judge, if this gets to trial. I'm just gonna refer to him. I'd be referring to him as Mr. Todgers the entire time. 
And then well, if he gets mad, Mr. Todgers, that's what it says on your complaint. If well, I was gonna say, I was gonna, I was gonna, or like, or like, sir, are you Todd Todgers? <laughs> no. Okay, this case, case is missed. This case is missed. <laughs> Defense not complaint is not here. Summary, dis, summary dismissed. Summary favor. Summary judgment in favor of the uh, defendant. Cordured. <laughs> Uh, what a fucking world. I don't know. I'm I'm wor I'm I'm worried about the Epic versus Apple lawsuit. Does hey. anyone follow any of that mess? Yes, <laughs> unfortunately. I just I just appreciate itch.io itch itch being the unspeakable oh game market. Oh my god, that's hilarious. That was hilarious <laughs> to me. Like of all the bullshit to come out of this. There, it. <sighs> Your Honor, we can't even name any of this stuff. It's too dirty. Ugh. I'm like, just because there's a bunch of, like, games that are maybe more, uh, adult-oriented than what you get on... <clears throat> not even what you get on Steam. Steam's right? got a bunch of that shit, yeah. too. Steam's got a ton of that shit. It's all over. I was gonna say, it's just, it's just it's much queerer. Itch.io itch is just much, 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 much queerer because, you know... It's a safe space for independent developers, yeah. mm -hmm. which strongly mm -hmm. attracts a bunch of people who aren't Are... the mainstream, weirdly yeah. enough. <laughs> which, I mean, just... the good news is it means that a lot of those people have a creative voice that can be expressed. That's kind of cool. That seems like a net positive. Yep. Seems like it would be good, right? All right, I've had this in my head for like the last 15 plus minutes. It's called JG Wentworth 877 Cash Now. 877 Cash Now. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Well, you guys are. They they have that commercial here. I'm in Oklahoma. <laughs> they still play him in Oklahoma. That that was a, that was my childhood, man. Incredible. Holy cow. Yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you have do you have a cash settlement and you need money now? Call JG oh, Wentworth and we'll buy we'll, we'll buy we'll buy your we'll buy your long term settlement for dollars on for pennies on the dollar. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. That's that's what oh, my structured gosh. settlement. Yeah. Your structured settlement for your asbestos lawsuit you won. That was more on the Hupie and Abraham side of the fence, actually. God well, in Wisconsin, in Wisconsin that'd, be, that'd be Hubie and Abraham. That was like their that's, the, that's their deal. They they, they were they were the Wisconsin they paid, asbestos lawyers, yeah, they were, they and were they sure paid were. William Shatner to oh, do a William bunch of Shatner. their commercials. They sure did. I mean, <laughs> William Shatner is an actor who will do anything for enough dollars. So I don't know if he really needed those dollars, but boy howdy, he was there for it. <laughs> he sure got <laughs> They sure gave. He him probably had to do like money. he he had to show up in a suit, do makeup, do like one take, and leave. He yeah. probably got paid like six plus figures for it. That's like easy. That's like he's like hell yeah. It's like all these made-for-TV movies that star Bruce Willis now. Bruce Willis shows up, and does for two days from shooting, does one and a half scenes, and gets paid like two million dollars, <laughs> and get then leaves. <laughs> and some and some aluminum magnate in Russia has their movie starring Bruce Willis now. I. Uh... That's a lie, because aluminum magnets and aluminum magnets in Russia play Eve online. And that's where they spend all their money. I, that's not a joke. That's an actual thing. <laughs> Part of the great history of Eve online. A time that there were some lines funded literally by a Russian aluminum magnate. Oh, I just need to live a little bit longer, please. Or no, is the extend at one mil? I think it's at one mil. Please, just a little bit more. <clears throat> uh, 
Yes, it is at one mil. Hmm, very good. You got the extent, congrats. I did. <clears throat> I must survive another 500,000 pointos to retake number one. It's not going to happen, but I can dream. Oh, not like that. <laughs> Little a hole. What the hell am I even supposed to do about that? Fuck you. Oh, come on. Oh, don't even, please. Yeah, I'm waiting for you to do your dumb bullshit. Come on. No, not gonna do it. Oh. Oh, now I just lost sound entirely. Good job, Rayforce. <laughs> Doing the Lord's work here. Oh, <laughs> damn it. Engine. <sighs> All right, not bad. Oh. Okay, okay. so that's that. Okay, get the sound back. So I'm using the migration data, data migration amount. Only like 100, 100, 200 gigs maybe. Not bad, not bad at all. I mean, that's ridiculous compared to doing Rose's PC last year where she had like 25 gigs of data to move, but. <laughs> It's like half a Steam game. Most of it was music. 160 gigs. Nice run. Now I see what Steam games I care about have cloud saves and what don't. <laughs> I need to sort through my music myself. I think I got like 300 gigs of Happy Hardcore. That is a lot of Happy Hardcore. <laughs> that, is a, that is an unfathomable amount of Happy Hardcore. I used to DJ Happy Hardcore at raves. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Well, so that I got a kind of variety then. Because like, who? I not not that Three, I 300 games happy of happy hardcore, hardcore is just a lot of happy <laughs> hardcore to have for one person though yeah like not that I hate happy hardcore by any stretch but god damn that's a lot of happy <laughs> hardcore <laughs> one of these days I'll have to dig out my gear and do a DJ stream nice <laughs> you should talk to LK Hetzel because he does those sometimes too he does do the DJ the DJ Okay, that I think I should be able to sync. Rebirth, I should be able to just sync from Steve achievements down. So I'm not too worried about that. Oh, it's off screen. No, how dare you? <laughs> oh. Uh, Jackbox games don't care. Have don't have saves. Don't care. Uh, old school musical. What about you? You cloud save? You do cloud save. Okay. So that covers yep. All of my remote play together games. <laughs> <laughs> Ace Combat, I think you have Steam Quota. I also haven't played you in like two years, but maybe I'll get the DLC now. I'm half tempted to double dip it just to be able to play it on uh... Steam Club. Well, see, I no, have I'm, the PS4 I... version. So... <laughs> no, 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 I'm, so, I'm saying I'm saying it has Steam Club support, so I don't have to worry about moving stuff. <laughs> Uh, 
Chance of Fire and Ice. I think you have seen Quetzal. I vaguely recall seeing that. Yes, it does. Cool. Alright, I'm done. You guys have a good night. You too. See Take you. care. Have a Talk to you guys next time. Sounds good. Take, uh, have a good one. Alright. Had that moment where I realized I'd already said take care and I had to think very hard about saying a different thing. Enjoy your meal. Thanks. Yeah, you too. Happens to all of us. Enjoy your meal. My favorite is when I write like a two, three line long like explanation on something and it uses the same word like five times in there. Oh, oh yeah. My God, I do the same thing. It's the best. <laughs> And then you reread it and you go like, why the fuck did I just like fixate on this word? Whatever the oh, whatever God. word. And it's usually like some connector word. So you get actually like five times or something. It's like, why the <laughs> fuck am I fixating on actually? God damn it. And then you like hastily try to edit it before they have a chance to read how bad oh, God, here you are. <laughs> Uh, the mood of you just got fucking run over by yeah, that. Yeah, I know. I thought I could destroy it before it got <laughs> to me, but I was incorrect. <clears throat> Hearthbase does not have Steam Cloud, but I can't remember. I think their saves are online anyway, so I think I'm safe there. Very good. Hellsinker weirdly supports Steam Cloud. Oh boy. That's an unexpected <laughs> one. Why? <laughs> that was not expected. I think once I have my new PC, I'm actually going to try and make a go of playing No Man's Sky for realties. <laughs> I keep playing, like, I'll play like five hours, like two to five hours of it, and then I'll stop. It sounds but like I really with, like any, it. with uh, any RPG. I really like it conceptually. It's just like buying myself to play it. <sighs> All uh, right, I'm heading out games. for the night. Have a good one. All See right, ya. have a good one. Take yeah, care, everybody. Games. Do you support Steam Cloud? You do. Cool. Burrito burrito. That means we'll pick up on Yakuza Five where I'm at. Nice. Assuming Yakuza 345 remastered and supported as well. They do not, of course they don't. Uh, last one. Browse local files. <laughs> Save? Nope. Uh, is it in like documents somewhere then? I hate when games saved in documents. Sega. No. Sega games? No. Bond, it astonishes mm -hmm. me how much you're playing with fire, trying oh, to like shoot down those <laughs> bits before they crash into you. The points, man. The points. I need the points. Actually, I, I probably don't. This run is to don't, toasted, but I don't disagree with ah, the sentiment fuck. of needing the points. PC Gaming Wiki says it does support Steam Cloud. Just Steam doesn't say it supports Steam Cloud, so we'll trust. We're, we're trusting them. Okay. If it doesn't sync my like, data, I'll be mad at PC Gaming Wiki. So yeah, like nothing I care about requires me to sync any data. Just copy and data. Cool. Very good. That means I am technically done. Ah, technically done. The best kind of done. I think I have to, I have to double. <laughs> I have to double check to make sure there's nothing on like my C drive I actually care about. Some of these dodges are. Uh... Not the cleanest, yeah. Dodgy. Yeah, yeah.
On, you needed one more lock on. One more lock on. I You'd have gotten <coughs> beautiful large 25600. The big puntos lock on. Puntos. But I get Instead, spooked. You got the moderate puntos I get lock on puntos, easily. which is not nearly as good. I think I'm going to lose my locks and I get spooked oh. and then I fire off early. I'm like, ah. Oh. No risk, no reward, man. I know. I know. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Very good then. Oh, so I'm gonna be right back. I need to refill the bev. So, oh yeah, that's that. I should probably migrate. <laughs> I'm glad I remembered to keep looking for stuff because I forgot to probably migrate my folder with like all my streaming layouts and crap in it. Ooh, yeah, those are important, <laughs> as it turns out. How big is my jump folder? 2.3 gigs, cool. Copy. Paste. Okay, I have returned. Welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> and I ah! returned to Bond, like, nodding appreciably at a stage one <laughs> score. Hey, it was not bad. It was almost 400k. That does seem like a pretty good score. I believe is. Okay, I think I've got everything me. backed up that I need to get backed up, so. It means I can inject the drive, and then I'm good to turn this off for now. In theory. Oh. So. Um, I, I did, but 
I did close it. I think they should be using the device. <laughs> Windows. Okay, so the hard drive is safely ejected and in the drawer of backup. All right. Good. <sighs> And just chill until I want to start. Like, honestly, I should probably just get the new monitor set up now. But that's gonna be like disconnecting everything and starting redoing wiring. I'm not sure I'm ready for that. I mean, when does the uh, computer arrive tomorrow? Do they say about when it was? Uh, by 1:15 was the estimate from UPS. Okay. Take tomorrow, uh, like a half day or something to. I did not know. I'm gonna do it in the evening. Uh... Yo, yo, Hello. yo. Uh, two uh, Bond plays shmups, and we all heckle. This so, business as usual, and, and possibly a uh, SVC experience, <laughs> and, and then be try hard for uh, in like 17 minutes. Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, I'm uh, probably gonna pop off and contemplate things since I finished all my backing up. Okay. Right. Have a good contemplate, yeah. uh, and congratulations on new computer finally actually for real existing. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll take some pictures. It 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 may not you be passed. as <laughs> it may it may not be a, it may not be as gamer because of the gamer. motherboard switch. I mean, that's fine. I <laughs> Bond, bond. My, CPU, my, C, five... my CPU cooler has fucking RGB lights. Oh no, why though? Oh god. <laughs> I mean, my... because I prefer big air coolers, and they didn't have any big air coolers that weren't RGB. Okay, oh. that's that's fair enough. <laughs> my GPU is it was the more expensive that, like, to... RGB lighting, and it's just a cycling rainbow effect as opposed to like customizable or any garbage <laughs> like that. Oh god, that's even the worst because you can customize it to like red or something. Sure, or blue to match the uh, case. Fan. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. You're... Yeah, that's all. I, I don't remember what I did. I don't remember what I did case fade wise. Let me look here. Let me find the invoice. Um, but what I will say is, uh, it doesn't quite have the full gamer aesthetic, but it is like a giant beastly monolith it, of a tower, it, and it's beautiful. It is. Mm. Yeah, it is are, a beastly nice. tower. It's it's like a solid, probably three feet tall. Holy shit! Yeah. It. It's, it. it, it it goes <laughs> it goes like halfway between my my knee and my hip <laughs> it is a tall boy oh my god very tall boy <laughs> it is extremely beautiful extremely tall boy it is <laughs> I, I think I have pictures of it. Like it is a it is a very chonky machine. Yeah, as as a person who has seen it <laughs> in real life, yeah, no, it is it is big. You you do not move that. <laughs> I mean it's a tower, you're not really supposed to move those much anyway. Yeah, yeah, don't yeah, yeah you're not supposed to, but it's still like some towers like if they're like the smaller all right, size. Alright, alright, so what what's what's RGB? Uh my cooler? Oh, my oh case. Boy. The case fans that come on are RGB. Okay. Uh, the power PSU is RGB. Naturally. Oh. Of course. And okay, that's about I... it. Oh, okay. Well, unfortunately, the motherboard I swapped to does not have any RGB controls, so I'm going to figure that garbage out at some point. I might like buy like a separate control, like an RGB controller and, uh, or something. Like a, P a PCI RGB controller. Or something, you know. Yeah, like, I, I have no clue what you would buy for that. Almost certainly a PCI controller, yeah. Uh, Why the fuck is this a 27 megabyte image? What the Christ? Why is uh, this... Why is this picture enormous? Uh, because phones have stupid cameras <laughs> oh, now. Oh, God! Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, like, if you got a phone, like in any of like the last like five years it's actually just ballooned so much yeah but 
Fuck. But the I fidelity. didn't need it to be, like, a literal 30 <laughs> megabyte <laughs> image. It has to capture the true chonkiness. Uh, yeah, like... Let me, let me, uh, take, like, a snipping tool of the fucking thumbnail instead. <laughs> Yeah, like clearly, clearly, I just need to get the Razer firmware adjustable RGB controller for forty dollars. Oh my god, why though? Oh god. So I can control the RGB on my PC. I guess. <laughs> if I have all the RGB, I might as well. It, yeah, like if it's more than just one thing at that point, because then you can coordinate them all. Yes. Because I I have a very simple plan for my case fans. They're going to be a temperature indicator. It's gonna go from blue at like 30 Celsius to red at like 80 Celsius and just go <laughs> through with the huge ah, shift. Practical. And that'll be, that'd be what I'd have on my PC, on my CPU cooler. Uh, Basic, basically, just temperature sensors everywhere. Temperature sensors. Temperature sensors everywhere. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Very good. But yeah, no. Um, for what you calls it, uh, like TPD, I've been like six to six forty. That's been my average, like my range. So we'll we'll see how well that. Like it, it depends, like because I think I might be the lowest one because like I still have my like pre pre end uh, units. Mm. So yeah, you, I can I can like easily you want the big puntos junk for this because it's yeah, stupid. So. So what I might just do is do like because I, I can't get up to forty today. Do those. Maybe do a couple mom and pops so I can get mother factor. Good luck. It's kind of finicky about actually dropping it. It is, but at least it's easy. And I have what those are RD five RD or RWB fives, right? Which? Uh, mom and pop. Oh, what the. Uh oh, but they're fours, but I have like infinite amount of fives. That's yeah, right. but in any case, any of them, like you probably shouldn't have a problem. With no, them. uh, let's see. Surprising. Okay. Oh, yeah, no, I have uh two k two point two k fours, and then four point four k fives, and I know you have way more than I do. I actually don't know if I have that many. Uh, 5,700 fives. So I have a good amount, but it's not yeah. like that much of a chunk over. Although All I right. apparently All have right. 3.6k fours. Alright, well I'm popping off. You'll have a good evening. Okay. Take care, right. beauty. See ya. Uh, so I don't see a star man. I may sneak on to a different call. A, to avoid bombarding you with, uh... Oh, yeah. With the PSO sweatiness and B to probably coordinate or potentially with coordinate others. with other people doing said sweatiness. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. So, so oh. best of luck on your forcing the ray. Thank you. May you I get will... all this of is... the lock on. I will do my best, which is not okay, saying much, later. but I will do it anyways. See you two all later. Right. Take care. Nice job. Nice job. Noise Jorb. <clears throat> into Stardust Stage 3. Hmm. I'd have made back a little bit on well, Area 2, I guess, right? Just the tiniest amount, but we've got a long 127,000 to go till extend, which is uh, probably not guaranteed. Got 
got too many arms guy coming up here. That's not a guaranteed fight for me because I get spooked easily. Too many arms. Oh, like that. <laughs> God damn it. <sighs> Not going great. Best we've done tonight is a, a hair past a mill. If we could push that to maybe 1.2 or 1.3, I'd call it a success, but got a ways to go before we hit that. That doesn't even touch the nearly 1.5 I had last time. right there that's nice this one's always kind of trickier because they're very tightly timed and I yeah lost the lock on on those couple there so I've got to find a different way to do that over 200k is not great. Oh, too far off on that one too. Great. from almost 400k from one time ago. Oh well. <sighs> See, then I go right in for it. Get bodied. other two just kind of fucked off. Alright, cool, I guess.
pretty clean out of that section. 639 going into boss approach. One more out of there. I was going to get bodied by that. No, not enough room to move. <sighs> okay. Give it another go. Maybe a couple more goes and we'll call it a night. This feels like we're not really having much luck, unfortunately. <laughs> or skill. Also, equally unfortunately. these, right? And then this quick pop of eight. And then I think I just need to wait this out a little bit more until those other dudes appear. Oh, or I could just get bodied by that fucking laser. Great. Cool. I'll just torpedo this one and try again. I can wait for those guys a little bit more, but I need to be more careful about where I choose to be to wait it out. Oh, why did that one just fly off into the sunset? I can get that sixth one out of there too. That'd be nice. Full set there, right? And these eight are a pretty soft touch. What was I gonna do about this? Just kind of wait for a minute. I don't know if I got them all there. Get that full set of six, and we're already at two hundo. So good. that dude on the way through. That's alright. Looks like we're in pretty good shape here anyways. Got to an extra two there. Alright, well, 275 into the boss this time. Good. 
power up really early on, so it's going to take a little bit longer. So, I don't think there's any sort of time bonus associated with it, so we should be alright. See, now, there we go, a solid 404, so we routed that better. <laughs> a little bit better, anyways. Kind of fucked up the intro on that, that's alright. Six oh eight. Seems pretty solid. that one a little bit. Ooh, definitely would have gotten bodied by that if I had not been careful. Okay, 748 to boss approach. Full power. At least one more out of there. 760. Alright, we didn't get much out of there. Just don't duff up the second boss fight, we'll be in good shape. It's gonna be difficult though, this one's. Always kind of throws me for a loop, because I'm an idiot. Mm. I kind of fucked that one up, though, because I don't know if that's supposed to have been done quite like that. So I don't know that he's going to pop out any more dudes. Really like him too, but I don't think he's gonna. Oh, all right, we fucked it up. That's all right. Oh, God. torched by that last one. one left of course there was all right well 936 in the area three is pretty solid <laughs> should be in good position for the one mil extend but it's gonna count on some fancy flying to get us through the rest of it <sighs> fuck <laughs> fuck 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 fuckity fuck all right let's see what we can do
Too many arms, dude, is coming up. I'm gonna focus down his right side, but I don't know if that's probably a, not as good of an idea. Especially when he does that shit to me. Oh, and I got him. I think I got him before he fucked off, so good job. Oh, fuck. Yeah, now we're kind of fucked a little bit here. Oh, come on! And then he bops me from below. Ah. Uh... Yeah, that was a, a good opportunity, and I just fucking threw it right in the trash. Good job. Good job, at an over 400k area 1. Pretty solid area 2, except for that bop at the end, and then I just totally fucking tanked on area 3. Good job. Good job, idiot. <sighs> well, oh well. That's what happens sometimes. Well, often. Whatever approach I did before, though, was really good for that middle group. I'm gonna try to do that again. All right, let's do the we'll do the one, two, three on that one instead. That, 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 one, two, three there. Sure. Do the one, two, and then that full group. And this one, of course, is one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, good. All right, we're gonna try to wait this out again without getting totally idiot there. I don't know if I got them all. That's group of six now. I'm still sub two. 200k after that, it's not great. Mm. No, no matter. Six there. The extra two there, and there, okay. 213, mm. That's super good. See a 344. Yuck. Fucking disgusting. Already down 60k. Oh, and I still got torched by that. Interesting. me on the way out. Alright. Yeah, that's okay. I didn't deserve to move that one any further anyways. Alright, maybe one more good go. And then we'll call it. It's not been going great.
Oh, okay, and then I just get bopped by the first fucking bullet? No. No. No, that's not how this is going. <laughs> I don't know if it's better to split those up or go for the combos there, but it's alright, I guess. That, hit that one, good. Eight there. Oops, I did that one a little bit early, if that's alright. At least probably get a slightly higher bot for that, and I don't even know if that balanced out. I guess we're at 200k for that, so it's not bad. Miss that guy again. Whatever. Oops, forgot to wait for that last pair. But 240 into this instead of like 206 or whatever, it's better. Oh, come on, I swear I moved away from that. But I guess I didn't. Oof, okay. 379 out of that. Mm. Not ideal, and then we're down a laser too, so... <sighs> Shit. <laughs> Why is it always like God. always the bullshit there? I wonder if I move forward too quickly there if those other two behind just take off really suddenly my chances of a good thing. Hmm. 526 into the transition here. It's not great. Some down a laser anyways, so Ray.
637 into boss approach. No stock. <laughs> Not ideal. Get one out. more out of there. Two more. Okay. <sighs> Hard to corral those into the right spot. Okay, well, this is pretty much a lost cause. But we'll play it out. Oh, and then I fucked it up by popping it to the transition point too quickly. Room, okay. 26 into area 3. Hmm. Still a bit silly. Oh, come on! Then I caught the tail end of one of those? Bullshit. Oof. No. Okay, one more. Then we'll call it. Because that felt really not good. Even area 1 were really inconsistent on. It sucks. Maybe a seven. To watch how many targets that is. Hmm. I missed one in there. It's all right. One eighty isn't bad. Missed an extra pair there somewhere, but 260 into boss isn't bad. Don't 
go off screen. God damn it. A hole. Well, nearly 400. Better show than any of my other runs tonight, so let's see if we can make it work. That's usually the group that gets me. Good, nice and clean. Okay, so there was a second group behind there. All right, good. Transition feels a little low. Oh my god, and then I get bopped by fucking rockets. Thanks. Shit. Great too. Good job. Oh my god, really? Yeah, let's see now I'm just throwing this one straight in the trash. Good job. to 7-Eleven and to uh, boss approach. <sighs> How many we're gonna get out of that? One more, one, two more. Yeah, so we only got two ships out of that. 5k apiece. <sighs> well, if we bop this boss, we might get close to the extend, but... That's going to take a whole lot of doing. K out of area two. No stock though. <laughs> Relies on me not eating shit in the first quarter of this stage. Which is um certainly not guaranteed.
damage than too many arms, dude, comes swinging in here. Jackass. Dumb lasers. And then he fucking just crosses up. Ah, you bitch ass. All right, that's it. <laughs> We're done for tonight. Ah, the fucking cross up gets me every time. A crossfire, whatever the fuck. But all right, we'll we'll call it there for this eve. An attempt was made. Not a very good attempt, but an attempt nonetheless. But that'll do it for tonight. Uh, so no stream tomorrow, no stream on Saturday. There will certainly be a stream on Sunday. I'm not sure when that's going to be, though. It'll be late evening. Late evening with Sunday Long Play Spelunky 2. Um, and then next week, Monday, 7 p.m. CT, we'll be starting a new game. we got to pick something out. Pick something off our ever-growing list of games to play. But we'll be starting something new on Monday, and then again on Wednesday, 7 p.m. CDT. And then next Thursday, it'll be, um, more Shmup Club. Club, Club. Uh, new shmup for month of June, so that'll be fun. But that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. I will see you on Sunday. Bye-bye.